Well, good day to you wherever you are. You join us on a day where the weather just may have an impact on a football match that has been uh, much anticipated. It's dry at the moment, but the forecast is that it will be wet, perhaps very wet by the time the game is uh, underway and certainly by the time of the second half. The crowd, though, are here and they are in good form. There's a right old cacophony going on. The atmosphere is terrific and kickoff is moments away. Well, this really is a great venue. It adds so much character to every game it stages. The crowd rises for the national anthem of Slovenia. got the juices flowing and now this think this turns on Jim well Peter I'm a huge fan of the Kaya Saka someone always praised for his versatility his attitude and, and his cleverness around the pitch he has the potential to excel in in all positions across that front line but I personally like to see him as part of a, a front three I think he operates best in that area yeah the easiest way to make a difference is to score so no argument there And we're underway. Palmer. Now it's Kane. Out to the right. Kane. Kane! And that's caused a worry or two. Oh, it's a very good effort. There wasn't much wrong with that at all. We're talking fine margins now. Fevich. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Well weighted. Dashing forward at pace. That a foul? Yes, the uh, referee's given it. That's been one straight back, and it's Kane. Palmer, he's through the middle. And that'll go straight through to the keeper. Well, Peter, look how far up the fullbacks are getting now. This is really high. And constantly after the ball, aren't they? Yeah, I think they're, they're weighing up their options to see how long they can sustain this and, and suppress those wide opposition players. Well, that looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. Palmer. Oh, real 
real danger here. He's away. Saka! Big relief, it just needed better contact. Yeah, they've got away with it, but that was a, a defensive letdown to see him march through like that. Now it's Kane. Bellingham. Plenty waiting in the middle. Saka's delivery. And he's there to cut it out. Shaw. Dinks one in. Alexander Arnold. It is deadlocked. Thirty minutes gone. Gets the better of his man. Intervention was very necessary. Palmer. Now it's Kane. Oh, nice touch. Timely intervention. Tries to get it forward quickly. If you have just joined us, you'll be glad to know that you haven't missed a goal. Now a chance to break. Palmer. And here's Kane. Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. Played out to the right. That could be a big one. Slovenia produced a lovely sequence of passes there. It's a terrific brand of football to watch. And importantly, it is a strong end product. So we have our breakthrough. Yeah, this is also a chance to see what happens to their level of concentration from here. Kane. Kane goes up and over. Plays it back. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. We hit half time. And there we are. Off they go for half time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half. But there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. Well, it hasn't exactly gone to plan so far. But there's no need to panic. There's still plenty of time to get back into this. As always, an early goal would help swing things back in their favour. Here we go again, then. England don't need to press the panic button just yet. 
they may have to tweak their, their setup first if they don't grab an early goal in this second half. They can't hold back, though. Now it's Saka, and here's Kane. Stones gets it back. Palmer. Now it's Saka. Now it's Kane. And that's sprayed out wide. Nicely controlled. Good clearance and very necessary. Saka. Oh, that's a foul. Which side of the line is that? No, the referees judged that the offence took place outside the area. Yeah, well, they were exposed and, and vulnerable, and he knew he had to do something to prevent a goal then. Well, this is a very real chance, and should it go in, it could be a big game-changer. Alexander-Arnold, ready to try one. Tries a shot! What a great finish, but how about the touch? It just allowed him to put the ball exactly where he wanted it, and the rest became a formality. certainly made things interesting. Well, I think this is a case of anything you can do, we can do too. I mean, they're matching each other like for like here. Fevich. Out to the left it goes, deep cross, and he's there to clear it. It's a loose ball. Looks to dink one in. Defenders on the back foot. Saka drives it forward. Fedic. Palmer did really well to intervene and dispel the growing danger. He's made sure that that won't get through. Rice. Saka. Cooks through there. Balls out on the left now. Oh, that's neat. It's a brilliant interception. England showing a good level of intensity at this stage. They're calling on all their resources now. Rice does well to read it and intercepts. Concentration levels are very good, and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner. England merit full marks for their attitude and application in trying to win this. It means an awful lot, obviously. Now it's Kane. Oh, Red, he sorted that out. 
And that has been clubbed away. Both sides then taking this chance to turn to their benches. Saka, who put amongst the goals, is being taken off now. Well, has he done enough since his goal? Is the feeling that he's lost his appetite for another? It's difficult to be sure exactly what the thinking is, but his race has certainly run now. Fevic already, of course, on the score sheet. And the counter is on. Now it's Bellingham. Yeah, he's fouled him there. And they can go again. Decent ball. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. Jose. Now it's Foden. Shaw. Tries to get it clear. And that's that. Well, no winner here, but an intriguing game. The result, probably a fair reflection. It has finished all square. Would you summarise what we've seen today then, Jim? England can always take more positives from a result like this. Yes, there is some tidying up to do, but some real promise too. Many thanks to Jim, and with that, it is a very good night to you.